things going on YouTube, so you know it's best here, best here. Hey, what's going on world? This is so much you know it's best here. Now I'm talking about something that is very interesting is has grabbed my attention from the first day I heard about it and saw it, and that's called OnLive. OnLive is a new service that's going to be coming out here shortly that provides um, instant on-demand gaming. All right, so it's meaning for, um, from your PC or your Mac or your TV, as long as you have an internet connection, they'll be able to stream you a video game that you can play. Um, so, I mean, something like this for, I, I never thought, I would never thought something like this would be able to possible because of latency issues or the possibilities of lag, which can just kill the gaming experience, especially in multiplayer. Uh, but they seem to have working out. So OnLive is a service that has some developers that develop QuickTime and some other um, big things that are a big part in the computer, computer world. And uh, they've been working very secretly for a few years here to, to try to perfect this, um, this product as much as they can. And so what it is, is they're gonna set up um, different servers around the country and uh, depending on how far you are, you'll be able to access that server and um, be able to go online and just instantly browse a list of games, choose a game you want, say Grand Theft Auto, click on it and it'll start playing instantly. They say instantly, they're saying it's going at the speed of light, so they say instantly, we'll see in real life testing. Uh, but they did a test here at GDC, the Gaming Developers Conference, and um, they did a, a test or a demonstration of them playing Crisis on a netbook. Not a netbook, but it was a very low-end Dell. It wasn't a netbook, I'm sorry, but it's a very low-end Dell. Uh, so something that had integrated graphics, you know, not the highest processor or um, or RAM, nothing like that. It's just a very low-end Dell, and they had it up on the wall playing Crisis easily because that is possible. Like I said, even before, even on the netbook, you'll be able to play it because it's just streaming it on the web, so it really doesn't worry about your hardware. Um, the basic requirements for this service is really just an operating system. Um, Looks like the base operators, uh, basic uh, requirements for it is Windows XP or Vista or an Intel based Mac running the current version of OS 10. So everybody, everybody pretty much has that. Um, now, now the way it works is in order to get uh, different, they do have two different resolutions you can get. To get the standard resolution, you need to have at least 1.5 megs down, and to get the 720p high def resolution, you need to have at least 5 megs down. So all that is pretty doable. Almost everybody should have that by now, at least at least the 1.5. And um, and it truly is fast. Now the demonstration they're showing, like scrolling through the games and choosing the game that you want, is I mean it, it looked extremely fast. Um, and actually, you can have your friends on there, and the community is pretty well too. So if you log on and you can see your friends playing, you can actually see all of them playing and click on it. And you'll be able to watch them play the game. No matter if it's single player or multiplayer, you'll be able to just watch them live, kind of sneak in on them. And I've uh, been playing a sports game like Matt, and that would be good to try to see what strategies they're using. Um, but anyway, that's good. And um, also, you'll be able to record your favorite parts while you're playing a game and upload it to it's like a braggers clip or something like that. You can brag about it. Um, uh, pricing, um, they do. They did say it will be subscription. They have uh, subscription plans for it. No word on what exactly that price is going to be. And um, I think there's a possibility you'll be able to just buy one game at a time or something like that and be able to stream it. And they're going to want to have it, so as soon as the game comes out, it's available on their service. And they already have some big partners online here. they got EA Sports, Ubisoft, NVIDIA, Atari, uh, Epic Games. they got a lot of big developers already backing them, already putting money into this product. Because I think they really do think it's going to be successful. Um, and so that's pretty much a description of it. You can go to www.onlive.com to check it out for yourself. They have a video running there. You can actually see it. And I think this is really going to open the door for a lot of stuff. And like I said, I always say, if you've been following me on Twitter or watching my live stream on Wednesdays, I think this is the future. I think that this is the essential cloud computing. Everything is going to the cloud now, meaning everything is going to the Internet. I mean, as long as Internet connections is everywhere now, so you'll be able to reach it. And one other thing, this is really going to open up the Macs, uh, Mac platform for games. Because right now, Macs have the hardware to play games, but it's just not that many developers uh, developing games for it. Um, so this is really just going to move that off to the side somewhere. You're not even going to worry about that no more since now we'll be able to get the games right online and hey, you don't have to worry about the hardware. So again, this is good for PC users. You don't have to worry about upgrading your PC that much or you know having the latest graphics card. You can just play it on your, your Dell Mini 9 or whatever. <laughs> so 
Uh, I'm very excited about it. It'll be launching here in the winter. Like I said, beta coming in the summertime. Just sign up for the beta now on the website. And uh, let me know what you think. Leave a comment in this video. Let me know how you think about this. You think it's going to be successful? You think it's going to fail? I uh, think it might be still impossible. I'm kind of on the fence there, but uh, we'll definitely wait to see some real world testing. All right, so you've been best. If you haven't seen me yet or you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you do. I think you'll like watching all my videos there, and you'll be automatically notified when I release a new video, and you'll be automatically into the any of my giveaways just by subscribing to my channel. And y'all take it easy. Peace.